Okay, I've got Moblin 2.1 running off a USB key on my Toshiba NB205. And basically you start off with this little desktop screen, but if you go to the top of the screen, you get a little drop down, or I can hit my Windows key. And here's where you get the different areas that you can work in. Notice the little bouncy animations and all, it's kind of neat. It's, it's a little more refined than it used to be, which is nice. Uh, my zone is just your main screen that popped up real nice. And if I had any appointments or calendar set up, which I do not, that would be over here. And there's a nice little welcome video as well as the last two web pages that I've been browsing to. Here's Twitter on the side here, and it's you see it instantly updating. Here's somebody's picture even, which is kind of neat. So I guess it goes out to TwitPic or wherever they posted a picture. That's pretty slick. I don't have sound, but I'm going to show you the um, notebook intro video. So you can see how it plays back. I'm not sure why there's no sound. I've double checked all my settings. Everything looks to be okay. I, I'm not sure why it's not working, but in any case, this is really fluid and smooth. I really like this. Maybe I'll just video their video because it shows Moblin better than I could show it, probably. Um, actually, that's enough of that. You get the idea. So that's the media player. I don't have any music, not that we could hear it anyway. The video was right there. I don't have any images in there yet. There's a play cue here. Play. Close that. Um, let's go over to the web. It's Firefox. It does allow for plugins to be installed, which is great. I like how on my Toshiba NB205 I can actually scroll using the touchpad like I can in Windows. I'm going to do that right now. Perfectly fine, it works, which is cool. I've got my page up and page down, so that's all well and good. Um, let's see, we can open up a new tab. This is going to kind of look familiar with people who are using a more modern browser these days. Favorite pages automatically going in. Everything is pretty slick and fast considering I'm running it off the USB key. It's really not too bad at all. So, we've got your standard Firefox type controls up here. Zoom in, zoom out. I had mentioned the add-ons and such. Boom, there it is. Plugins, extensions, themes. It's all in there, which is nice. Now, I'm not going to close this. I'm just going to use my little start button and go to, I don't know, status. Here's where I can work in Instant Messenger, or in this case it's Twitter. That was my last tweet. I don't really have much set up here. Since I'm on the USB key, it didn't make sense to set it up. I may actually install this though for good. I don't have any people in here, which is interesting because I did sync up my Google Contacts. So let me do this. Let me go to the applications. And here they're broken down to various areas. Games, internet, media, office, settings, and system tools. Oh, uh, where did I have my contacts? It's probably an office contacts. It's just a basic contact editor. Do you see how that just switched from one to the other? Here I can do a search. Whoops, that's all I want to search, which is down here. It'll search on the fly. I have two for James. One, I'm not sure why I have two records. It could be because of my, the way I've got him set up. I'm going to block his contact information, but I'm going to show you that it pulls in his little avatar there from Google, which is pretty cool. So let's close that. And what else do we have? Well, let's go back to applications and get a rundown of what it comes with. Obviously the favorites, which I should be able to pin different ones if I want. Media player, web browser, this is the default. Got different accessories, calculator, screenshot, terminal. Uh, let's go into games. I actually did install Blackjack. I wasn't sure if it would actually install. Let's see. Yep. Since I'm running off the USB key, I wasn't sure. But I went to the Moblin Garage, and I'll show you that in a minute. And I grabbed Blackjack for what it's worth, just to play with something for a couple minutes. Come on. Boom. All right, pretty basic. Yeah. How do I do that? Do, 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 do. Oh, deal. That would be good. Uh, yeah, that's not good. Would I like insurance? Nah. But you know what? It'd be nice if I could double down, could I? Could I? 
I know I shouldn't against the nays, but I'm going to. I have to push. Okay. You win some, you lose some. Sometimes you push. Uh, let's close that. Close my browser too. No, I don't. Well, let's go back to the apps. Get a little bit more of a look at that. Internet apps, email, messenger, sync. Sync is where I went before. And I've got 484 contacts that I sunk, so to speak. That worked perfectly well. I'm not able to use the calendar or to-dos through Google. I'm going to have to look at that and see what other ways I can do that. Oh, let's see. Everything's really slick and fluid. I can't say that enough. I'm very impressed. Webcam booth. Gee, I don't know if my webcam's going to work. Oh, the blue light's on. Glad I took a shower today. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Well, let's... F hey, look at that. Cool. So, camera, me. All right. Could do video, start recording. Sure, I'll record. But I don't see any video. Hello, world. Hello. Stop. There's different effects. I'll have to take a look at that, too. Oh, there we go. It's saving my video. Cool. All right. I'm going to fix my hair. Everything looks good. All right. Uh, let's see. What else? Well, you get the idea of how the applications are ordered here. We've got different settings. I am settings. I should have set up I am. That would have been good. I could have had a little I am chat with James. Trackpad mouse. I have been in the sound. Unfortunately, it hasn't helped me. Let's go to the mobile and garage real quick. Let's go to the garage. So you've got top 10 downloads. You can search for things. You've got accessories. Not too much in here just yet, but come on, it's only just beginning. Oh, so you can see Blackjack installed. See, I only installed it because it was the first thing in there. Ah, system disk usage analyzer, some other good stuff, pretty cool. Um, over here, we've got your networks. I can connect or disconnect. I actually did plug in my USB 727 in hopes, but no, that did not work, no 3G. Bluetooth isn't working either, but that could be because the Toshiba BIOS has it set to off by default. So I don't blame Moblin for that, because I know that these guys worked on Bluetooth support here. So uh, Output volume, we've already done that. Mute is off. Play test sound, no good. All right, battery, yep, I'm 81%. I'm actually thinking about running this on a full-time basis just to see how far I can go on the battery. Really, I just need the web. So if I can do that in an efficient operating system, this might be my little smart book. I don't know. Bluetooth's unavailable. Ah, uh, zones. Apps you're using here. Okay, yeah, I'm not using any apps right now, but let me let me open up a few. I think overall it's relatively snappy. Uh, let's see. Calculator. I'm just opening up apps willy nilly. Okay. Now let's go to zones. Uh, so here's where I can pick and choose, and I guess as I add more. Uh, text editor, it will, yep, there we go. Can I do an alt tab to switch? Oh, looky looky, yes I can, cool, very cool. Okay, or I can go into my zones, right there, and I can pick and choose there. Nice, very nice. Media, we've already looked at, not much there to see. Internet, we've looked at, people haven't done anything there. Pasteboard looks like a clipboard. Um, again, I haven't used that either, but I guess we can close the calculator. I really like this. I like how it's, um, the animations work. It's pretty, pretty sweet. In any case, you know, running off a USB key, this is actually not too shabby. Um, not too shabby at all. I wish I could search for things right in the bar. I wonder if I can. Um, Let's see, let me see, let me see. Fix Apple keyboard with um, foil. I wrote a post on that. Oh, look at that, I can do it, very cool. Uh, I was hoping mine would show up, but it's not there. Okay, so it's almost like the awesome bar, and yeah, I can do searches. Very cool, very cool. Let's open up in Gadget, see how that works. Here, it should be perfectly fine, boom. There it is. Not bad, not bad. I think I could use this. 
Um, I wonder if there is a full screen mode on this or not. I will have to play with that because I'm really starting to like this. I'm really starting to like this. Well, anyway, that's enough of this. That is just a quick look at Moblin version 2.1 for netbooks and net tops. And does anybody else say anything interesting on Twitter? Let's see, let's see. I like how I can just... Hey, Jason, there you go. Nathan Filling, very cool. I like this, I like this. Anyway, that's a look, short overview of Moblin 2.1. You can download it for free. It's pretty easy to get going on a USB stick, which is what I'm doing. And, uh, well, if you need any help, they have it on the Moblin site, or you can just ping me at kevin at gigaohm.com. Have a good one.